Hey there, YouTubers. How's she going? All right. I had a mail call from Hillbilly from Hoosier Hillbilly 22. So he sent me a sticker. The reason this mail's been, this letter's been open is because I tried to do this a couple days ago and I forgot to charge my GoPro. So it kind of went dead in the middle of, uh, <laughs> in the middle of what I was doing, so. We'll give it another shot. So he sent me a sticker. Thanks, Brad. That's cool. And on his live stream, he had one a 1969 half dollar. So that's pretty cool. 40 percenter. Don't get too many of them up here. So we love that. And then Brad was generous and he threw in a few extras for me. He threw in this cool three cent piece. Which is a little piece of silver, that's kind of cool. She's pretty worn, you can't make out a date on it or nothing, but still neat. She's some small, she's about the size of, well, I think it's even smaller than uh, one of our fish scale nickels. But that's pretty cool. Thanks, Brad. Love it. Then he also threw in a 19... What was it? 37. Buffalo, nick, buffalo nickel. So... That's cool. I love the buffalo nickels. I think that's about... I think I only had three of them, so... That's about my third one right there. Love that. That's cool. Then he also threw in a 1943 steel penny. The steel weedy, so. Gotta love it. Love the weedies. And he threw in the 1944 Weedy. Sweet. And he threw in a 1940 Weedy. So. Gotta love it. Love the Weedies. Thanks, Brad. I appreciate it. So if, I, if you haven't checked out his channel, I'll leave a link down below. Go on over, check him out. He does a live stream every once in a while, usually on a Friday night. And when he does a live stream, he usually gives away a, a half dollar, so you have a chance of winning a half dollar. And we also got a package from Mr. M.A. Lyman. Now this was for uh, for what was it? It was a five dollar donation. On his live stream. Super chat, that's what it was. Oh, that's the word I was looking for. Five dollar super chat. I give him five bucks and then his next live stream I threw another two bucks in on it so cover the mailing cost figure that was only fair but one of his famous U rock cards oh and he sent more stickers Digging with seven. Gotta love it. Man, I tell you, I'm getting quite a sticker collection. And then Crispy Kiwi Adventures. Gotta love it. Man over in New Zealand. New Zealand. Crispy loves his silver. 
then Palm Z metal detecting. Ooh. How cool is that, man? This is cool, Mike. I really appreciate this. This is a bunch of stickers I do not have. And then Relic Recover Recovery B3. Look at that. Awesome. Another one I don't have. That's Adventures. He's over there in Australia, the young fella. That's a, another sticker I don't have. I do have one of his black stickers, but I don't have this sticker. This looks like a reversal for the inside of a windshield. So That's cool. And then we have Rob Random. Jeez, Mike, you went all crazy with the stickers here. Another one I don't have. That's pretty cool. And then UK Mel Detecting. Stefan Pedican, I believe that's how you pronounce it. That's pretty awesome. And then, of course, this famous fella, Santa. Mr. M.A. Lyman 24. You got to check out his channel, man. It's awesome. I'll leave a link down below. He has awesome live streams. Does awesome videos. Him and the boys are always good for a laugh. They're comical. And then uh, all the business cards. So M.A. Lyman's got a business card. The Yupa Girl. She's got a YouTube business card, J3B, Lemonhead Penny, she's got a YouTube business card, a ah, little dirt digger, Emily, cool little business card, I like that one, Em, and then Tony, Relic and Jewelry Recovery. Frangella, Tony Frangella. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, but he has a YouTube business card. That's awesome. Thanks a bunch for the super chat. I appreciate it. Here are your prizes. Hope you enjoy that, Mike. I do enjoy them, Mike. I appreciate that. And then here we got taped up all the little prizes. Man, I tell you, Mike, you got quite the hoard of stickers going on. getting quite the collection from everybody we got ourselves a little one gram silver that's pretty cool try not to spend that all in one place Cool little buckley, Doug. I 
I don't know what that would be off of. But looks like she's brass. That's pretty cool. I'll put that with my relics. And we got a penny, Doug. Man, I don't think I can make a date on that one. My eyes are too bad for that, but that's cool. And we got another penny, Doug. can't see dates but if you can let me know I know the dates there I just can't see it my eyes aren't that good so that's cool and I guess this is supposed to be a bird tag that he dug Maybe it came off the carrier pigeon that he was going to send this parcel by, but who knows? That's pretty cool. I forget. I think he said this was a cow tag. Else he dug. It's actually got a date on it, 1948. That's pretty neat. And I believe it says Connecticut. Yeah, that's pretty neat. Different. Well, thanks a lot there, Mr. M.A. Lyman. You're the one that rocks. That was an awesome gift. And before my GoPro went out, when I was trying to do the mail call the other day, I also did a coin roll hunt. And I went through some quarters. And what I found was a poppy quarter. So that there was a 2004 poppy quarter. That was the first colorized coin that Canada ever came out with. And then I found three of Liz's Digging Canucks favorites there. We got three of the Mounties. They're all a small bus though. But I hang on to them. I think they're pretty cool myself. Found a non colorized poppy quarter. That was 2015. We found the Stanley Cup quarter. Hundred and twenty five years of the Stanley Cup. Seventeen, I believe. Then we all 
also found the cancer quarter. It's got the pink ribbon on it. That's not in bad shape. Found the Sir Isaac Brock quarter. To commemorate the War of 1812. Got the red maple leaf on it, so that was cool. We also found the D. Salaberry quarter. Again. That's to do with the War of 1812. That came out in 2013, that quarter. But she's got the red leaf on it. We also found a quarter with the Canadian flag on it, non colorized. There was what? Well, that was to commemorate 50 years of the flag. Yeah, that was 20, 2015. February, I believe it was February, February 65 was when the Canada flag became our official flag. Before that, we were flying under the Union Jack, I believe. So that was cool. In the last giveaway, I gave everybody two weeks to get a hold of me. to collect their prize. J3B got a hold of me, he got his coin. East Coast detecting he got a hold of me, he won he got his silver silver dollar. One other person ever got a hold of me. And that was for the Laura Secord coin. With the red maple leaf on it. So This is going to go with these coins. Which is going to go into a giveaway. And last but not least, in my coin roll hunt the other night, my favorite coin of all I found. Was a colorized Canada flag quarter. Commemorates a flag. Fifty four years ago now, when that became our official flag. Man, that is a nice, nice shape. That's such a cool quarter, I want to keep it. But I already got, I believe I got two of them, so. We're going to put that in a giveaway. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all these quarters here. And they are going in a giveaway. So if you want a chance to win these quarters, all you got to do is be a public subscriber to my channel. 
you got to hit the like button. This time I'm going to check in to make sure you're subscribed because I, before I never bothered. And I know some people weren't. And what else? I'll go over to Metal Pirate Girl's last video. She just did a video for uh, she just did a video on learning about coins. So go over there. And just for the heck of it, see Marty says get well. <laughs> and then come back to then come back to my channel and, and put down in the comments done. You will be entered for a chance to win all these awesome Canadian quarters. And I believe that's it. Can't think of nothing else. So, that's what we'll stick to. Go over to Metal Pirate Girl's last video. Which is where she's uh, starting to research coins, and she done a Canadian coin there. I believe it was, I believe it was a twenty seventeen lard cent. So just go over there and say Marty says get well soon, and then come back to my channel and just down in the comments below say say just put done. So we'll have a little fun with her. I'm sure she'll figure out which Marty it is, but so that's it. Do that. You're in the draw, and hopefully I'll have that draw next weekend. All right. Thanks everybody. Till next time. See y'all later.